Hey guys, Doug here from Trigger King. How's it going? You guys always ask, you know, what are we using on our trucks? So for this edition of Trigger King Tech, I wanted to talk about the SMT tens and what we are using for the wheelie bars, specifically the RH Designs wheelie bar. As you can see here on my nuclear banana truck, here is what the wheelie bar looks like. The actual kit. I'll take the body off here. You can see it right there. It's just a simple, uh, you know, two plates. Basically, a, a little bit of a 3D printed uh, adapter in there, so it fits snugly between the frame rails. And then these, uh, you know, like the urethane rollers on the back, which are the actual, you know, act as the wheelie bar and let it roll. And I wanted to talk about these for a minute because a lot of our guys are using them. And you can see here is the footage that I'm splicing in here, some of the trucks that have them. We've been using these for a long time now. And the more, especially as the, the trucks start jumping up in speed and we have more Pro Mod SMT10s, you really need to get a wheelie bar on them or you're going to start ripping the bodies up. This is my nuclear banana body. I don't know if you can see here, um, but it's split all around there. The other side here, you can see here pretty good. Um, I pretty much ripped the whole back of it out. Uh, you can see here again in the video as I was running uh, running wheelies last event, the body is what absorbed the brunt of the uh, you know of the wheelie, and that that can't happen. It was also pogoing, and the rear of the body is what took it, especially on here because I cut out a bunch because I think it looks cooler. Um, I shouldn't cut out as much, by the way. I know I shouldn't, and on future bodies, I'm not going to cut out as much. But you do have to cut out some for the SMT10 cage. So, anyways, um, it created a weak point and. Yeah, it just uh, wanted to rip the body. I actually, for to get it through the next event, or, I'm trying to get as long as I can out of it without having to paint another one, um, but I have tape on it here, and I actually have shoe goo under that to reinforce it. But anyways, the RH Designs wheelie bar will alleviate that problem. You can see here with it on the, uh, with the, the body on the truck, that wheelie bar extends out past here, so when it comes straight down, it, that's what it hits. It doesn't have the body you know, uh, ram up into it, which even if you don't have it cut out, it still causes issues with the body. You can rip, tear them. That's one of the big things that does it. Uh, wheelies are just notorious for it because it's that constant pressure. Pogoing is bad, um, but the wheelies really just want to rip the whole, the rear of the body out. So yeah, these wheelie bars, they, they alleviate that. You know, we've been using these for a long time, so uh, you know, they've proven very durable and they've, they've helped. Not only do they save the body, but if you don't have anything, a lot of your rear axle, sometimes that pressure can come on the rear axle when it goes to the tires, goes in there, can bust lockouts, do other things. It's just better that the wheelie bar handles it. And in a worst case scenario, if you really get nasty, the frame would take the brunt of it. Um, but again, these do a fantastic job of uh, you know helping everything out. Ross Hinshaw is the RH in RH Designs. And uh, he also, he's probably most known for the SMT10s as he does these short wheelbase kits for them. Um, but he's quickly becoming known for these as well. These are just, these are awesome. So check out RH Designs on Facebook. I'll put the link below, and if you don't do Facebook, I'll put his email address down there too. Just uh, look in the description of the video, I'll have it on there. Solid, solid product, and you can see in all the videos the abuse that these trucks take and the wheelie bar really, really helps save bodies and it saves parts. So, all right, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you next time.